Hey guys, welcome. Linux Mint Debian Edition LMDE6 Cinnamon Desktop. Question was asked the other day since LMDE6 does not have a driver manager, how do I install an NVIDIA graphics driver? So, this is a video about that. So, I thought I'd answer that in a video. So, I have two steps um, for you. We can do this through terminal or we can do this through software manager. My preferred is terminal because it's very quick. It not only installs the driver, but it also installs the graphical version of the NVIDIA settings. I will say welcome folks filming in 1920 by 1080. You are watching this on Linux for seniors. This is just a watermark up here. There should be a brightly colored icon in the corner that you can click on if you like to subscribe. 300 videos and growing on all kinds of tips and tricks. This is just a watermark. So if you don't see that icon, go look for Linux for Seniors on YouTube. All right, so a lot of people don't like Terminal. They're new, they may not be familiar with it, but I'm gonna to try to get you comfortable with Terminal. So I'm gonna to try to make this larger for you. There'll be a little bit of screen tearing when I do this, but that's okay. At least we'll understand the process. So Mary's our user for today at, and the name of the computer is LMDE6 dollar sign. I used to use this command quite often. The INXI command is just system information, but I'm gonna put in a dash big FXC. That strips out personal stuff. So then I'll scroll to the top. And I will talk about LMDE6, codename Fay. All right, it's a Debian 12 bookworm. So you can see my motherboard information, CPU, and I'm gonna scroll down to, to the graphics. So this is a GeForce GTX 1050 Ti, and you can see that it says NVIDIA driver on it, and that's the version number. If you see this word here, in this position, that means you are using the open source driver. Now, LMDE6 normally installs the open source driver for NVIDIA graphics cards, as an FYI. That's why when you display this information, take a look at that setting right here. Your biggest clue too will be also that you won't have this right here. So in your settings box, on 21.3 Cinnamon, you will have a driver manager, but this is LMDE6, so you don't have one of those. So how did I install this? I'm gonna walk you through that whole process in a minute. But this is where you can actually display that information. There is a second way of doing that also. You can also open up SY and go to System Reports and go to this information box and take a look at the graphic info in here. Okay. Anyways, let me move on now. I'm going to hit Control C. I'm going to hit the word clear to clear the field. I understand a lot of you folks are new and you're not comfortable with terminal. Maybe you're brand new to Linux in general. So I'm going to try to step through this very simply. This is my history buffer. These are commands I've punched in recently. I have two of them that have the word sudo apt install on it. This one here is the one we're looking for. Okay, so basically what I'm going to do is copy that and put it on that line right there. And then I'll walk you through the whole thing. What does sudo mean? Sudo is super user do. It gives me elevated privileges to do something. In this case, install something. So sudo space apt space install is the command for installing something. Then I put another space and the name of the software or package or program. NVIDIA dash driver in this case. And then I hit enter and it'll ask me for my sudo password. I put it in and it'll ask you one more time, do you want to install that? And the answer should be yes. And then it'll continue its process. And then toward the latter part, almost toward the end, it may produce a pop-up box to tell you that to complete the install process, you should reboot your computer. And you'll acknowledge the box and it'll continue a couple more lines and then it'll finish with a dollar prompt flashing at you. Now, this part here gets the software from the same locations as your Synaptic Package Manager and your Software Manager. 
you're not going out to the internet to install stuff. Okay, this is getting it from the same sources that you have already. Just wanted to be clear about that. So here's line two, sudo apt install, same as the front part of this command, except this one has space simple screen recorder. That is what I'm using to record this video with. So now you know how to install simple stuff. Okay. So once you complete this box, you can either type the word exit on the dollar prompt when it finishes or close this box, but you should reboot your computer. Do a restart. Okay. Once you restart the computer, open up your settings box and you will have an NVIDIA settings. Set. That way you can get more information. I'm going to close that, bring this to the center. Your driver version number in graphical form will be here and also the NVIDIA information on the card itself. It'll tell you how much memory normally you will have in here in megabyte form. 4096 MB translates into four gigabytes. Tells you how many CUDA cores and all that other technical info. Okay. And then your system settings display is where you change your screen res and refresh rates and also your scaling. Normally your cards will default to the highest screen res that your monitor will support and your card. In my case, it's that one there. And it normally has different scaling also, at least on mine. Your card may be different. Okay, I'm gonna hit cancel. Now let's say you wanna uh, shy away from terminal. You wanna do all of it through software manager. Since I normally don't install the driver through here, but I will talk about you can find it in here. You may have to do it in two steps. And why do I say that? Because I'm not sure if the software manager installs this tool here at the same time. That would be that one, okay? But in either case, in your search field, type in NVIDIA and dash driver and look for this package right here, NVIDIA driver and install that. After the installation, reboot your computer and go look for this box right here. If it's not here, open up your software manager one more time. And this time just type in the word NVIDIA, no dash driver. In other words, just like this. And it should be at the top. So you just be able to click that and do the install from there. Okay. So a recap on terminal, okay, history, line number five is your installation command and uh, reboot afterwards. Software manager, same, NVIDIA dash driver, and I'm not sure about the NVIDIA settings. You may have to install that separately. But in either case, um, your screen res is picked in here though. You should be able to use this box rather easily to change your screen res and your refresh rates and whatever's available on your machine. Thank you for watching.